Cassidy Spinelli was deployed overseas in the Navy when she gave birth to her son Dante. He was born at just 36 weeks and taken to the NICU. He was given an MRI and that's how we knew, oh my gosh, tears already. Um, that's how we knew he um, was given the diagnosis of cerebral palsy. After six weeks, they were medevaced to San Diego. Her life was changed forever, but she was determined to care for her son and continue her career. She eventually completed her active duty and is now in the Naval Reserve. You know, you never, you never get pregnant um, thinking that you will have a child um, such as Dante, but um, I, I can say he's my biggest blessing. He has taught me nothing but patience and true love and compassion. I had zero patience before Dante. <laughs> um, as a reservist, she was still doing double duty as a mom and as a mobilized member of the Navy. Um, I had one thing in my mind um, when, when I was uh, mobilized, and that was to, to save money to get a wheelchair accessible vehicle for Dante. I mean, prior to mobilization, I, I, I was really struggling to get him in and out of the car. Um, and so, so I went on mobilization with that, with that focus. I was going to go save money and, um, you know, do what I needed to, to do for Dante. She was connected with the Semper Fi in America's Fund, which helps wounded or ill service members and their families get the care they need. The fund helped Cassidy get the wheelchair accessible car she desperately needed. And that's not all. Over the years, her case manager, Sierra, has become a friend. Uh, wow, throughout the years, I mean, hospital stays. Sierra sends me um, gift cards. She sends me care packages, sends gifts for Christmas. Um, they're like the family you never knew you had. It's a really great feeling to, to be able to hear from a service member and go, you know what, I get to fix that for you. Um, you kind of feel like Oprah. <laughs> it's, it's a great feeling. One of the things Sierra helped Cassidy with was moving her and Dante across the country to Pennsylvania. Oh my gosh, when they got on the airplane to fly from California to Pennsylvania, I was like a hot mess. Um, <laughs> I was so worried about them and I was like, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Um, it's, it's a great feeling to be able to um, create relationships with people. Um, you know, aside from the, the financial assistance, just to create relationships with people. Um, I think the feeling's mutual. I feel like, you know, they're a part of my family. It takes a lot of strength to do what Cassidy does in the Navy and as a single mom, but it also takes a village and Sierra is that village. You know, if I'm having a rough day or we're having a great day, I can reach out to Sierra and I know she's, she's like my lending ear and my shoulder to cry on. 